It was cold and dark, but Maddie didn't mind. She wanted to find the stars. It was muddy and chilly and hilly and steep. Maddie didn't mind. She could nearly touch the stars. She's asleep. <laughs> I did it. You did it. You're a natural wilder. Secret nurturing spirit, eh? Hey, don't tell anyone. Mm. Maybe you could tell Tilly. Yeah, she'd be impressed. You reckon? Yeah. Is there anything else I could do? Like change nappies or get a bottle? Mm, not right now. Let's just enjoy the peace, eh? Should I keep reading? Yeah, yeah, that would be that would be awesome. I'm just gonna make a call, okay? Okay. Hi, it's me. Uh, um, yeah, it's it's a miracle. Me and Wilder bonding over babysitting. Yeah, yeah, I'm happy about it too. Oh, what? I thought you were babysitting. Yep, she's at home with her mum. Oh, I missed all the fun. Oh, you should have seen Wilder. He was a natural. Yeah, yeah. And now he's behind on his homework. I don't care. I'd rather look after a screaming baby than do English. <laughs> It's the first time we've actually connected. Mm, my beautiful new life will do that. Yeah, I got straight on the phone to Maeve, just to show off. <laughs> Did she uh, say anything about Roz? No. Why, well, see over there, the lilac grower from Levin. I didn't ask. Well, why don't you ring up again and just see what's happening? Mum, I'm not gonna ask Maeve to spy on Roz's boyfriend. You talking about Jason? Yeah, tell me what you know. That he's a dick? I need details. Mum. Has Nana Roz still your special friend? Well... Not anymore. Why? Because Nana Ross is a hoe bag. Wilder? Well, he's heard worse before. What's a hoe bag? A, a tea bag. Look, he said... He said tea bag. Look, I've left my tea bag in the cup again. It's a terrible habit. <laughs> Couldn't do that in front of the Queen, could I? Teeth in bed. Yep, that's what we're doing. Hi. And, uh, talk later. Hello. What? That language was inappropriate. I need you to apologise. Well, get over yourself, Nick. You're not the boss of everything. No, I didn't change any nappies. That's gross. Yeah, I just read her a book and she went to bed. Uh, just how much? Yeah, English. Got a test tomorrow. Hey, you want to speak to Mum? Do you think that's a good idea in the mood I'm in? Nah, she's cleaning the kitchen. OK. No, Mum. I thought you would have told her already. What would I tell her? That we were having a lovely time and you ruined it with bad language and bad manners. Look, I've got a lot of stuff going on right now, OK? OK. Well, does it have anything to do with Tilly? Because I know TK and he would have something to say about your behaviour tonight. I just got a lot of homework and it's really hard. Well, life is hard, Wilder. You can't just be rude to people and get away with it. OK, I'm sorry. And you can't talk like that about your grandmother. She did lie and cheat. It's none of our business, OK? English homework, do you need a hand? I'll figure it out. I'm here if you need me. <sighs> Honestly, I don't know who's more useless, Drew or the nanny. She didn't even bother to say goodbye to the kids. She sounds like the home help from hell. Yeah, and then, of course, Drew dumps the problem on me. It's like, hello, who's the father? Breakfast before you go, please. No, I'm good. Look who I'm babysitting today, little Sky. Oh. Mm, three hours max. Well, I can pull a slippy if you like. Oh, no, I'll have it sorted soon. You shall go to work, Cinderella. <laughs> Excuse me. What? We have a guest. Hi. Bye. See ya. Oh, I am so sorry about that. He's just a teenager. You should have seen us last night. We were chatting away like we were friends, and now he hates me. Why? Basic discipline, enforcing manners. Well, she'd leave that up to Maeve. It doesn't really work like that. Maeve's son, Maeve's problem. Just do your own thing. He's a part of my family. Yeah, but you're getting all tangled up. You know, you're worried about him, invested in him, and it's just a waste of time. You are joking, right? 
I'm just saying, pick your battles. What do we have here? Who are you after, Nick or Maeve? How do you know it was me? <laughs> Don't know, good guess. Mufty day, is it? Oh, it's teacher only day. Oh, the perks of being a student, no work and all play. Actually, I was wondering if I could do some more work now, if that's OK. Not really. Oh, hi, Wada. Hey. Mm. You'll need it. Where? In the condor room, just to check the ambience. Oh, uh, what, what now? Yes, now. I have to man the landline. Oh, kid, you know how to answer the phone? He's not credited. Well, he found the fiend. He's got the cred. Yeah, and I'm keen for work. Right, you're on. Come on, Emma. Uh, all right, just, um, just take messages, OK? What about the data entry? I've done it before, I can do it again. OK, but I can't pay the living wage, all right? Just the minimum, under the radar, dodgy youth rate. I'll see I don't care as long as I'm learning from you, Damo. <laughs> You're a pillar of society, Wilder. A pillar! Where's the... Wilder's having sushi for lunch. Oh, what happened to Vegemite sandwiches? I know, right? Hey, sorry, I'm, I'm texting on the job. He left the house in a bad mood, so I'm keeping the comms open. Ah, you go for it. Hey, how come you can log in and I can't? Oh, what, is yours glitching, or...? I've got nothing. Oh, maybe call Damo? That photo you sent me, so cute. Marley Picasso. Yeah. <laughs> I reckon. <laughs> Hi, it's Nicole from the nursing department. Uh, hello? Weird. Did Damo just hang up on you? It didn't sound like Damo. Oh, maybe it's got a low come in? Well, whoever it is, they don't hang up on me. Hello? Hi, sorry to just barge in like this. I'm Nicole. I'm having trouble logging in. Come on, on. Wilder? You just texted me from school. Yeah, about that. What are you doing here? Work experience? No, you're wagging. And you're lying to me. 